came third and drive the bottle in the itsy bitsy side and up the spout again. Every week uh, I have to sit down and talk to a family about that one of their children being diagnosed with a brain tumor. I started having really bad headaches and um, stomach aches sometimes. So that's when they found out I had the tumor and I had to have surgery. I'm uh, Jay Storm, one of the neurosurgeons at the Children's Hospital of Philadelphia. I am Naya's surgeon. I am Mary's surgeon. I, with my partner, Dr. Adam Resnick, run a research laboratory looking for treatments for brain tumors. Every year, more than 2,000 children are diagnosed with a brain tumor. Mary is four years old. She was diagnosed with uh, medulloblastoma when she was three. And um, she had surgery here at CHOP to have a brain tumor removed. Pediatric brain tumors are the most common cause of uh, tumor deaths in children. That's why it's so imperative for us to find a cure. Unfortunately, though, the funding from the government and the NIH is quite sparse when it comes to pediatric tumors. Mary, how are you doing right now? I'm good. Good. <laughs> really good. <laughs> there are very few funds out there for a pediatric brain tumor, so it's quite uh, important for us to get out there and uh, educate the community and uh, families and to have philanthropic support. Speak up for me. We need money for research. So the long-term goal that we have is to raise as much money as we can to make as many improvements as quickly as we can, and ultimately the goal would be to find a cure for these, uh, these tumors. Do you like bugs? Yeah, butterflies.